really does brown really go with the black i mean i don't really care people say like brown and black like it's a no but like who the fuck cares um if the colors are clashing i don't really care i think it looks good with my brown hair okay this is like my hair is like shocking me right now like how did it get this long? This skirt is from Paxson too. I really love it. It's like that parachute type of material. I really am going this summer for like skirt, like cute but comfortable. Like this skirt is super comfortable. It's like I can move in it. Like I don't feel like uncomfortable in it. Welcome to another vlog. Um, I... I'm home alone again. This is my first day. My mom left this morning and I'm going to party. I always just like get more, way more productive and like stuff when my mom's gone, I've noticed. I think it's just because like now, like, you know, I'm in, it's like, I got to take care of the whole house. I got to take care of the dog. Um, you know, I got to go open all the blinds every day do the whole house routine so it just like gets me up and at them it really it's honestly really helped me like get back on schedule with sleeping and being motivated to that's honestly why i've been posting so much on youtube is because i've been so motivated to work i guess okay i'm about to make my grocery list before i leave because if I don't, I buy things I didn't need, forget things I did need, and it's just like, it's not smart, you know? I took a picture of my list. I'm gonna take Loki out and then put him up for his nap, and then I'm gonna go to the store. so fucking hot i just checked out got some goodies i really was trying to like budget so i didn't get like really everything because i'm sorry but Publix, like you just never know like you could get the smallest grocery thing and it'd be like a hundred dollars okay sorry and get like and it'll be like a hundred dollars and you're like where where in this grocery is it a hundred dollars? Florida's on another level right now with heat. So we all know I'm moving back to Texas. Woohoo! I've been people have been asking me, "Are you moving back with your mom?" Like, of course I am. Yes, I am moving back with my mom. Um, I'm still saving up to move out. And listen, I will not let anyone shame me into living at home. Okay. advantage and save money. I'm excited to move back to Texas though. You know, all my friends are there. So, and I've been wanting to get a second job and it's pretty scarce over here. Not a lot of options. And since my mom told me I was moving back, I was just like, you know what, I'm just gonna wait till get back to Texas to get a job so hopefully this summer by the time we move back I'm gonna be like applying for jobs and stuff and it'll be fun I'm excited I've basically like had a year of just like much needed just like isolating myself working on myself figuring like what is going on in here and in here, I'm pointing to my heart. And just like what like I want to do with my life. I'm still like not like a thousand percent sure, but I definitely have a vision of how I want it to be. I'm also like as soon as I save money, I'm out. I'm moving out. Love my mother, but I gotta go. You know, I'm in my twenties. Like I I it's just like how I said earlier. 
I do so much better when she's not home. Not because I don't love her, but just because it makes me more productive. Like, I'm... Do you know? I don't know how to explain it. I don't know how to explain it, but like, yeah. I just, I'm... I'm very good when I'm living alone. But... And there are a lot of places I want to live. Like, Texas is... <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I'm excited to move back to Texas, but, big but, it's not my home. It's my mom's home, good for her, but it's not mine. Um, so, I will be working hard to leave. I want to go, I love the East Coast, like even though, um, our town didn't really work for us in Florida but to me I still don't like feel like I'm in the east coast I'm still in central time like that's how far off on the Florida panhandle I am so it's like I I just know I'm gonna live on the east coast when I'm older mm -hmm. I my hair on my face even if I look like an egg Okay, quick haul. I used to get these a lot right when I moved here and then I like stopped. I don't know, they're these V8 Energy. I like can't do a lot of caffeine, but I noticed with these, when I did drink these, they didn't make me, it, it didn't give me the same reaction as like coffee. Like I can like, I love coffee. <laughs> it's like bad, but I can't drink it because it makes me like have panic attacks basically. Um, so I got this because like I said in my one of my last videos, I've been like crashing in the middle of the day and that's just like not working for me. I just don't like taking naps, you know? So we're gonna try these. Okay, then I got my favorite salsa. It's the Chunky Mild or this in Picante. My mother's calling me. Hey. <laughs> Show, tell my mind what medicine you're taking that you don't like. Sherry medicine. The pink Ooh. bubble gum. It's nasty. You love that, right, Micah? The pink bubble gum one you loved. The amoxicillin. Oh, mm -hmm. that you got to go like this. Yep. Mm, that's tough. That's the only medicine I've ever taken in my entire life that I could like drink. I hey. don't know why. Go show them why you can take it. Come on. Mm -hmm. Well, I used to cry. I cried in like high school taking my antibiotics. Girl, you got it. Just do it really quick. Really quick. Got it. Why are you lighting fast? Two, three. Yeah! You're done now. Look at that. No more for the day. Bye, mama. Bye. Bye, girl. Hugs and kisses. My mom called me from my uncle's house with my little baby cousin. Cuties. Love them. Okay. My favorite salsa. I'm weird. I'm a salsa freak. I put it on everything. Anything that's savory, I could probably eat with salsa. I put this a lot on avocado toast. See, people might come for me for that, but like, it's just like when people put sriracha or like hot sauce on their avocado toast. I get these bread and butter chips because I'm a pickle girl. I could put a straw in here and drink it. Okay. It's just, it's how it's been my whole life and it's never going to change. Okay. Then I got, of course I have to get Florida Naturals orange juice when I'm in Florida. Duh. Duh. What's in here? I also got some tanning lotion because it was on sale finally. This stuff is so expensive usually for like tanning oil. It's usually like almost $15. Tell me why it was eight. So I'm gonna be using this today when I tan. I'm excited. I got some cuties. And then I got a lot of chips because I've been noticing I'm a snacker and I've been just 
slacking in my chip or like area. So I get these. This brand is like my favorite brand. Sorry, the golfers I just like know can see like straight in here and are like probably looking at me. So I got two of the light Caesar and one black pepper. I then I got the CHA brand of potato chips, sea salt, because it's made with avocado oil. I try and be mindful of what's, what ingredients are in the things I eat. Obviously, I'm not going to be perfect. Like, I'm going to indulge. But in areas that I can replace, that it's just easy and it tastes the same, that's what I'm going to do. So I do that with my butter, too. I do the country crock plant butter, avocado oil. Tastes just like butter. Literally cooks with it, nothing changes. It's the same, it's butter. Um, then I got the Chipotle barbecue. I haven't tried these yet. Sorry, that was gross. Let's try them. Okay, this is cheese. idea okay back and back pull one side in this is if you don't have a clip and i don't have clips pull the other side okay then you're going to take the pointed side and you would think you're going to roll it this way nope you're going to roll it the opposite way you folded okay now you have this and then you're going to flip these little tabs that you made over. Washing my sheets. That's what I do usually the first day my mom is gone is do all most of my laundry. Like my sheets. I need to wash my couch. It's been like over a month since I washed my couch insert. So I need to do like all my towels. Okay, like what's happening? Oh wait. It's giving me SPF. Am I supposed to open me tan? Because a girl needs it. I'm trying to really get better about it. Because, listen, here's the thing. Yes, protect yourself from the sun, but also the sun isn't like evil. We need the sun to, like our body needs it. So not very aesthetic.
Okay, so I left the vlog on. Off. Okay, let's. There we go. I left the vlog off on yesterday after I made my bed. And I said I was gonna do my hair. I did my hair. And I slept in it. And you're probably like, you slept in braids. Yeah, I did. It keeps these front pieces out of my face because they're really long right now. Um. And I just like braiding my hair. I know, it just stays. And it looks slick, whatever. Um, anyways, besides the point, right now, I just woke up like an hour ago. Had some yogurt. It's 9.22 right now. And I literally haven't like done anything. I just kind of got back in bed. I just brush my hair, brush my teeth. Um, I don't really wash my face in the morning because I wash it when I get out of the shower the day before. And after I shower, that's like I'm done for the day. Um, so there's nothing to wash until I shower today. Anyways. Right now, I think I want to, like, journal a little bit. I want to... I'm kind of behind the past, like, week and a half. This vlog is just going to be super random. I'm going to make this the end of the vlog. I'm just going to... These are my three journals. This is my personal journal. This is my... I have hairy stickers on them. Don't care journal. Like, I write whatever my little heart desires in here. Sometimes I write, I write a lot of like book stuff, like like this is pages books I read in April, and it's the rating so I can keep up with what I read so that when I do my wrap ups I can remember. I draw in here. It's just like whatever. It's like my junk journal. And then this is obviously my planner. Watch some. YouTube while I journal and yeah. Go of packing for like three weeks or more in Europe. So every single planning and planning my outfits and getting you guys the links for my outfits. Um, also have some really cool brands that I'm going to be working with on the road so I can continue working and creating content for you guys. Got some really. Okay, so I finished journaling. And now I'm gonna read on my Kindle. I'm currently reading The Kiss Thief by LJ Shin or something like that. I don't know. It's an arranged marriage romance and I'm 67% done. So I think I'm gonna finish this this morning and then for this vlog i hope you guys enjoyed i am going to edit past the day and get this uploaded for you and then i'm gonna read some more because i'm behind and i need to catch up but um yeah Thank you guys so much for watching, you know, subscribe, like, all that fun stuff, you know? Yawning. <laughs>